hey welcome back guys and today i have a few more tips and tricks for you while playing hogwarts legacy to make your life easier let's go when you're traveling in hogwarts legacy make sure you go to your map and do put exactly where you wanna go until you see those that and go back in your controller press the up button on your controller and see until you see the golden line this golden line was made to was put here to help you traveling exactly where you want to go in hangwar legacy instead of just running around and just getting lost everywhere anytime you're traveling in hangwar legacy make sure you go on your controller and press the button but you need to have the direction you want to go in your map first before you do that or you won't be able to do it in this way guys you'll be able to traveling way 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 faster and better in hangwar legacy the other tip I have for you guys, whenever you have your Wuma requirement unlock in Hogwarts Legacy, I will recommend you to go in those locations like Tom and School and buy those recipes. Okay? Like that, it will save you way more money just to go back and buy those recipes and plant those seeds yourself instead of just going around and just come buying little portion here little leaf here buy the recipes buy the seed and go back in your room of requirement and plant those seed yourself in the tom and school place it's a very important place where you can buy machinery pot large pot small pot to plant a certain seed okay make sure you read there's some seed will require large pot the pot there's a there's some seed required medium pot and there's other seed to require a small pot come here go here guys and buy all those recipes for those portion those portion are very important in the game they will help you in combat and everywhere looting and those things you can't miss them therefore you don't need to go here all the time and buy little lotion portion here you just come and you buy the recipes you buy the seeds and the long one it will save you a, a lot more money and make your life easier and make your experience better while you're playing Hogwarts Legacy. Go here guys, just buy those seeds, buy those pushing, buy those ma machinery. The other good thing in Hogwarts Legacy, you can still use the golden line to follow direction to the location you're going while in your boom in Hogwarts Legacy. But the caveat is you need to be on the ground first to cast the golden line on the map and after that mount your broom to go to the location you wanna go and follow the golden line. The other thing I have to guys, you can collect a items while you are on your broom in Hogwarts Legacy. If you see some items you wanna collect, you wanna loot while you're on your broom, you don't need to go down. You can just approach close to the items you want to loot and press square on your PS5 controller and loot the items. And the other things too, if you want to travel as fast as possible in Agua Legacy and your broom, all you need to do is just traveling as close to the ground as possible. Therefore, you don't exhaust the, the life of your broom. You see the yellow life in your broom graph down there on your right? If you travel high, you're gonna get exhausted fast. But if you're traveling low, like I'm doing right now, you don't need to worry. You can go as fast as possible in Hogwarts Legacy. Okay, this is a hoping port budget. The moment you have your room of requirement unlock, you need these items. All you have to do is go back in the Tom and School store and buy it. It will cost you $3,000. And man, that thing will push in for you every 12 minutes. You don't need to have any ingredient. You're going to boo a random portion for you every 12 minutes. And you buying the recipe once, you are able to have three in your room of requirement. Very important, guys. Don't sleep in it. Go buy it now.